Good morning, it's your boy, Chef Yard, Neasy, the Pip Master. Ladies and gentlemen, I called this the other day. I knew US 30 was going to come back and greet us. So we're in a trade right now. My group is in a trade. I gave them a 50 pip for now, and then I gave them another 50 pip. So we hit from 525 to 475 already. As you can see, that is a support line of mine, 475. But look, it's, it busted back into my channel. And that's what I was looking for it to do. Now, if I take my axis here, 33.217 is where I really have it going. So we're in a trade right now from uh, 400 to 350. Then we're going to take another 50 pips down. Possibly if, if I see it moving really nicely, I'm going to tell them to go ahead and take the whole 100 uh, down to 300. But this is what I gave my group and I taught I taught this training yesterday on what this is and why it's moving like it is. And the same thing for NAS. NAS is playing back and forth game, but if you look at the higher time frame, um, NAS looks like it wants to reverse, but it's bouncing off this yellow line. I still believe NAS will come uh, down just a little bit further into the 100 range. Um, somewhere down in this neighborhood here about the 180 range so looking for nas to possibly take a nice reversal uh soon if unless the market uh you know deems it favorable to go the opposite direction but right now looking at us 30 this is still in a good sell momentum um if you look at the lower time frame it's probably buying now let's see yeah so lower time frame has it buying but this I always tell people it cannot sit on this. This is nothing for uh, this trade to sit on. So it has to come down to make some type of wick because I am using Heikinachi candles, right? So it needs to make a nice wick. So it's almost there. Uh, I believe it's definitely going to come down and hit the bottom of my channel line. And we shall see from there. Now, what is this? All right, what is this shape? I was teaching this... Um, uh, also over the weekend. Now watch. This is, let's see, where is it? It's a continuation. Oh, where is it? Is this neckline? Double top? Nope. Where is it? Oh, come on, guys. Uh, is it that far down? It must be after all the angles. Here we go. This is uh, <clears throat> okay. This is a downtrend where this the downtrend resumes. Okay, it continues on. So it says if there is no clear trend before the triangle pattern forms, the market could break out in either direction. This makes symmetrical angles a bilateral pattern, meaning they are best used in volatile markets where there is no clear indication of which ways an asset price might move. Example: bilateral symmetrical triangle can be seen below. That's that one. That ain't the one I want. Symmetrical triangle form when the price converges. There we go. So we got convergence with a series of lower peaks and higher troughs. An example below the overall trend is bearish, but the symmetrical triangle shows us that there has been a brief period of upper reversal. So what does that mean? Um, right here, right, it shows us an upper upward reversal. Okay, it did the same thing here, and then it continued in a downtrend after that. So downtrend resumes. That's where we are with US 30. We had periods of an uptrend, periods, and here's my triangle. This is a symmetrical triangle, guys. Let me show you what it looks like right here. Bam. I'll draw it this time instead of going to bam. So that's a symmetrical triangle. Okay. And then um, we also have uh, another, I believe, symmetrical triangle that tried to form. Was it here? Let's see. Bam. This is a, yep, right here. Uh, I thought I had it. All right. Let's see. Grab it here bring this line down okay and there's another symmetrical triangle okay they tried to form here now we're working on an even larger move so what happens when the symmetrical triangle forms well what we have is a downtrend a fake uh pullback and then same thing fake 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 all right real fake 
and then here's the downtrend continuation right to complete this whole move and now i'm on a 15 minute chart so we're looking i'm looking for it to come down here to the magenta line in the rsi which should bring it all the way down to 34 33 to 15 or so to my level of support right there where it intersects so we're talking about a push out of something like this possibly to bring it here to where to where it actually intersects so that's my analysis guys i hope this really helps uh in the long run and to figure out how these markets are moving uh i told you lucid was going down to 18 and some change is well on its way uh matter of fact it just hit 1898 so i did tell you that last week i gave you a number for last week for lucid i don't know where my marking is but i did mark this chart last week um so i got lucid coming down let's see that's the 16 and then here right here so this is where i got lucid going 1856 okay and it can come down to 1632 so i'm going to wait for lucid to make all of his moves then we're going to catch this sucker because i showed my my team how tesla did the same exact thing the exact thing Lucid is doing, Tesla's doing this. I mean, Tesla Tesla did the same thing that what Lucid is doing right now. So I hope this helps. I'm looking, I'm doing a option on ADGI and ETRN. I'm on a put option right now with ETRN. Let's see how that's going. That's going really well. Yes, sir. Um, ADGI, I'm waiting on ADGI to reverse and pull back over this line because it's already hitting my yellow line here. It's going to pull back at least to about here like it did here which is that same triangle. And let's see what silver and gold are doing real quick. Buying up and consolidating. But NAS still giving us this fake to funk move, I guess, huh? So NAS is doing nothing but consolidating in the same zone. Look at this zone right here. This zone right here is all NAS. I believe NAS wants to break this zone. So I'm looking for NAS to come down here, possibly to break the zone. So waiting on NAS to make a move. Come on, NAS, stop playing. All right, lastly, US 30 still on the move, guys. Still on the move. That's what I'm looking for. So if you, I'm going to post this, and if you guys have enough time to get in, for those of you in the YouTube world, when I post this, you still can get in. It's still room, okay? All right, talk to you guys later.